speaking of money, hey, Dustin Martin, so you said oh, a few weeks furphy. ago that you're saying it's a furphy. I believe where there's smoke, there's fire. Right? Where there's smoke, there's rough car. So I want to hear yeah. uh, what Damien Hardwick had to say when asked about Dustin Martin this week. Oh, I think what I will say is he's a very important player play to our footy club, both on the field and off the field. And what he gives us, he's, you know, he, he's paid us in spades. Whatever just Dustin's decision is moving forward is up, is up to Dustin. And to be honest, he has my blessing. Like what he's given me, us, our fans, has been incredible. And whatever we get from here on in is a real bonus from my point of view. And here's Ralph Carr. Uh, he said he has got this year and then another two under contract. He's kind of set there, but who knows? Football is a funny world. So to me, Caro, until I hear the words come out of Dustin's mouth that I'm not going anywhere, I won't truly because uh, uh, players have the power these days. Whenever the players, what are you even suggesting with a contract, that he'll walk away at the end of this contract, or we might walk away he, before? Whenever he feels like he wants to, and whether he feels that Sydney is a place he'd like to be, I'm just I, I think don't contra- buy it. contracts I don't buy it. contracts I, mean nothing with. I just anymore. think he's mm. trained there with Paul Gallen. He's gone to a boxing match. All his support networks in Melbourne. But if you talk about tradition, he is one player that should be a one club player. Yeah. Like a legend yeah. of the Richmond Football Club, no greater player. Who wants to see him in another? No, no one They're does. They're the traditions you no want to keep. No one does. But w- if you're a Richmond, I-, I think if Dusty, you wouldn't fight and scratch. All I'm saying, I think it would hurt a lot of people because Dusty is a hero of the game. But they could also look at a guy who's turning 31 in June and say, okay, how can we make it work for us? So, you're saying maybe next year. Or whenever the time comes. But Karen, maybe it's easy to give you a blessing comes. when deep down you think it's never going to happen because exactly. you know the kid that, that well. That, that's exactly what I think. I heard Lee Matthews say he thought it was an odd thing to so say. So why doesn't Damien Hardwick just go... It's just rumour, speculation. He's because, going nowhere. Because he genuinely loves Dustin Martin. He might think that maybe there is some smoke there. Oh, yeah. I, I don't believe there is. I think that you say that Richmond could make it work for them in a trade sense and in a technical sense. Some things are bigger than trade, yeah. bigger than technical. They're Matthew Richardson being a one-club player. They're Matthew Lloyd being a one-club mm-hmm. player. They're James Hurd being a... Imagine if James Hurd yeah. had gone... Or if you'd gone to Carlton mm-hmm. in that... La- it, it's, it's just yeah. not the same. And, and it, it, it's beyond dollars. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no. so right, let's, it, let's move on, because it's not happening for two and a half years, contract. so let's yeah, talk about players it. Players leave before the contract. Who floated they can, they can do that, but Who floated it? Where did it come Where's from? Where's it come from? I'll tell you what. Hutchie I'll... on footy classified yeah. a few weeks ago. Okay. Oh, well, well, well it's credible then. <laughs>